Hello, Empowered Woman. Welcome to this episode of the Empowered Woman Podcast. Today, we'll be talking about avoiding VMS. What is that, you may ask? It's what I like to call vomit marketing syndrome. We've all been there, either doing it ourselves or being a victim of it. You know, when you love what you do so much, you forget not everyone in the world understands your jargon or cares. But fret not because there's a free training for that coming up. I am so excited to announce my 10K launch debrief where I take you behind the scenes of my 10K launches and teach you my powerful and magnetic content creation system that converts your audience into paying clients. Are you ready to stop vomiting your marketing? Let's dive in. Welcome back to the Empowered Woman Podcast, the number one show on personal growth, visibility, and profit for women entrepreneurs. If you're wanting to start believing in yourself, giving yourself permission to succeed, and let your voice be heard to make an impact in the world as an entrepreneur, this is the place for you. I am so glad that you're here. My name is Marta Spurk, and I'm your host, triplet mom, woman empowerment coach, and all things motivation extraordinaire. Welcome again, and let's dive into today's episode. Just a year ago, I finally broke through thousand and a little bit over a thousand dollar months. And getting to that amount, I have to confess, really felt painfully slow, especially consistently, right? Every month. I really wondered how in the world I would ever reach the coveted 10K months that everyone raves about in the online space. And then I'd hear from mentors and other people once you reach a certain level, it gets easier to make more. But in my head, I was just thinking, how? How is that even possible when even getting to 1,000 or 2,000 consistently is just so freaking hard? And the reason I'm so excited to be sharing what I'm going to be sharing with you today is that I am not some magical unicorn that was born hitting 10K months or that started their business and just, you know, grew overnight. And so this is exactly why I'm so excited to walk you through what exactly it took me to finally get there this year. And yes, once I broke through, every month has had an increase. October, for example, was a $12,000 month for me. And now I've officially tripled my 2020 income this year. And if I can do it, my friend, so can you. And I did it all with a very intentional content creation strategy. You've heard me talking about this over and over again, but I'm going to be sharing the specifics on the 10K launch and the content that I created that got me there in a 60-minute free training next week, November 11th at 9 a.m. Mountain Time. I am calling it a 10K launch debrief, and I will not only be outlining my powerful content creation process for a 10K launch, I will also be offering my specific scripts and slides templates so that you can do it too. So really saving you some time and helping you get there faster, because this is part of what I teach. I always say it's super meta, right? I tell you how to do it with your audience, and then I tell you how I'm doing it with you, essentially, and give you tools um, to get there faster with my help and and start implementing it. So before we talk about VMS, vomit marketing syndrome, let's talk about empowerment marketing, because this is really the core of everything that I teach. And I've shared before how once my business started growing so much, especially last year when I started focusing on marketing, I kind of resented the fact that I only started doing this then. Why didn't I start talking about marketing right away? But there's always a reason for your journey, my friend. So learn to appreciate the journey. I started everything with empowerment and then the marketing came in. And that's why I am calling it empowerment marketing because it's not just your regular marketing. It's really empowerment marketing. And it's understanding how to get your audience warmed up to you by making them the hero, by making them the center of the universe, the center of their universe, your universe, your business's universe, really showing them that you care and empowering them because that's what people want. They want to know that what's in it for them, essentially. And if you are not able to clearly convey that, you lose people, right? So keeping in mind the power of empowerment marketing is what is going to get you to creating magnetic content. And this is precisely what I'm going to be talking about in this training. You have to register the links in the show notes, but 
the outline of what I'm going to be doing in the training really is helping you pick the right offer because that is a very important point. Um, I have launched several different offers and I've attempted several different strategies, but ultimately what got me to a 10K launch in 10K months was a very specific offer. Okay, so we're going to talk about that. I'm going to talk about promotion period because that really, really matters because it's, it's the incubation, if you will. Getting people warmed up, it takes time and you have to be mindful of that. You have to have a clear framework. I've been talking about this, right? But I will outline and break it down in the training. Repurposing, obviously, because repurposing saves you time and it's repetition. It's all interconnected. But the most important one, last but not least, is learning to become a master and number one fan of your own content. It's taking pleasure and really finding fun in creating your content because if you're not enjoying it, it's going to come through and people are not going to enjoy it either. That's really where all the magic and magnetism happens when you really learn to fall in love with your business because then everything else will fall into place. If you fall in love with your message, with your marketing, with your business, people are going to fall in love with it as well, okay? So really, really keep that in mind because it's a very, very important part of the process. Now let's talk about the vomiting because I think most of us resonate with that and so I want to um, expand on it a little bit so that um, we're here on the same page. So all of this really came about because I was talking to a client the other day and she was telling me, Marta, I really need help speaking. I just stumble on my words. I don't know how to be clear and convey the value of my offers because I have so much to share. So where do I begin? And first things first, we all struggle with it. We have all either been victims of vomiting or we have done it ourselves. I think both, right? And the reason is, is because we're such geeks over our content, as we should be as experts. But then we fail to remember the, that the rest of the world isn't, especially our ideal clients, hence why they need our help. And one of the things that really got me going in this content creation mentoring space was when I started writing pitches for TV segments. If you don't know, I have um, been featured in several TV segments on a local morning show here in Denver. If you go to marchesbrook.com forward slash media, you can find, I think I've been on there seven times or so. I'm actually scheduled to go back later this month, right before Thanksgiving, so stay tuned. And the beauty of writing these segment, this, these pitches, is that you can't switch your own horn, you got to be succinct, and you still need to bring value. Those rules, simple guidelines, were so helpful to me in then creating my own content and understanding I have to get to the point fast because the segments are like three minutes long, sometimes even shorter. And it's not about self-promotion, right? Um, with your content, there can be a little bit of self-promotion, but keeping this in mind really, really helped me understand what effective content can look like. Because check this out. Nobody has time to, to read novels and try to make sense if it's not making sense already, right? Every human being is too worried about their own reality. We're egocentric. That's it. So you got to be able to clearly convey what's in it for them. Last but not least, you have to have a clear CTA. You have to have a clear call to action. If you don't tell them where to go after that, you lose them. So it has to be very clear and to the point. And these are just very simple guidelines to create magnetic content that converts and to cure VMS once and for all. So let me repeat those again. Make sure that you're being succinct, you're being to the point. Make sure you are keeping them in mind. What's in it for them? Why do they care, right? When you're writing something, make sure that it really stresses that. And finally, make sure there is a clear call to action. Are, are you directing them to your website, to your Facebook group? Are you directing them to a free training? Are you um, directing them to, a, to an actual sales page and to an offer? Make sure you have all those things in place and then you are not going to be vomiting anymore. And this applies to all kinds of content, right? And this is how you can really revolutionize and revamp your website, blogs, social media, email marketing, even what you say in networking meetings. And I, I have talked about uh, Polka Dot Powerhouse several times, uh, which is a networking net organization that I'm a part of. I've had a the, the founder come here on the show, go back and listen to it. Her name's Shannon Karate, and she's amazing. I really understood the power of being very brief when you introduce yourself, but being catchy, right? You have to be brief, but you have to be memorable. And I've talked about being making yourself memorable, right? Making yourself relevant so that people want to buy from you. I hope this was helpful. Keep these tips in mind, but of course, come to the free training to get the full scoop. Again, we meet November 11th and 9 a.m. Mountain Time. If you can't make it live, still register because I'll be sending the replay and then you can watch it on your own time.
Once again, thanks for tuning in today. I so appreciate you. Make sure you leave the show a review if you haven't already. That really helps me increase the reach of this message and impact more women entrepreneurs with empowerment. Um, all the links are in the show notes. Do register for the training and check out all my free resources. Um, and make sure you join my Facebook group because that's where a lot of the magic happens, the Empowered Women community. Until next time, bye.